Hi everyone! Welcome back to my channel and to those just new in my channel, welcome here and thank you so much for dropping by. I'm here again in my kitchen, one of my favorite spots of my house. And today I will show you one of my recipes. Tonight I will make grilled chicken with guacamole and celery on the sides. All right, so if you remember my uh, previous vlog, I showed you how to clean the chicken properly before you cook it. So this is the chicken. We need to debone it, and I will show you how to do that later. I would like to um, show you what are the things that we need in this recipe. I have a half of this lemon. I think it should be enough. And since these are very tiny avocados, so I needed three pieces, three avocados. This onion is like about medium size, not too big, not too small. And of course, ground black pepper, the salt, and the celery stock. I don't need all this. Pretty much I just need three pieces. All right. Let's debone this chicken from this thing. Uh, make... So first, this whole leg, I will just cut in half like that, it's easier, oops, take out this piece, like so fatty things in there, and you just uh, need to trim the bones, just make sure you're not taking out a lot of meat from the bone so you don't waste so much just trim around it like this and you need a sharp knife to do this yep a very sharp knife but you gotta be careful don't cut your hands There you go. This is my meat. The skin and it's still like And look at that. This is just the bone, like pretty much the just the bone. You see? So just repeat the process until you finish all your chicken. And the other part of the leg, just have to cut it somewhere in the middle. And the same thing, just trim around it like that. And there you go the other part of the leg. So this is all I have. There you go. This is it. We debone all the chicken. You just need to um, put salt a little salt, not too much, because you don't want it too salty. And this uh, ground black pepper. To me, I need to use a little bit only because my son doesn't like the taste of uh, the pepper. 
So that. And of course, make sure you have to mix it and mash it up like this. So it will even up the taste. Set it aside. And uh, while we're waiting for that to marinate it, we just need to do some. I don't need that knife. I don't need a chopping board. I need different chopping board and a knife for vegetables. Like I said, I need one, two, three, four, probably four, four sticks. I'll slice it into this long and uh, I don't like the this part inside of this thing just peel it pretty much yeah there you go all these celery stalks, they're all like pretty much the same size. Can you see? Yeah. Next, let's do the onion. And the avocado, I probably make two batches of this. in a jar for blending later. Okay, let's put for the batch. Just uh, put a, a small amount of salt and pepper. And leave it there. Squirt a little lemon in here. Yeah. And before we grill this, I also need lemon. Okay.
All right, to those that don't have any grill at home, we can actually use a frying pan. We don't need oil, all right? So just put in there, set your stove in a high heat, and wait for a while. Okay, the frying pan is already hot enough to put your chicken. You grill the meat first and then the last part is you're gonna flip it over and grill the, the side up with the skin. There you go, like that. Don't put any oil, all right, in your frying pan. You don't need oil for your grilling. Just cover it with paper towel. So it took me five to seven minutes to cook the other side. Now you can just flip it over. Okay, let's see the other side. You see? It's like this. It, it's not burned and at the same time it's not raw. So I'm going to take a plate and just uh, remove it from the frying pan. All right, let's make some guacamole. So this is the avocado and the onion, plus a squirt of lemon and salt and some pepper. So I will just uh, put it here and I use my magic bullet. It's easier. We don't want it so thick like this, so what I'm going to do is I will going to add a little bit of this creamer, just a little bit, and stir like that, put it back. This is done. Fresh guacamole. I'll open it and put it in the container. I mean bowl. ta -da! Let's scoop out some. Put it in here. Oh, 
voila here guys I will show you a closer look with the recipe tonight grilled chicken with guacamole and celery so that is the guacamole and the celery stock plus the grilled chicken yeah like that all right guys I hope you enjoy the recipe tonight and you can actually try it it's healthy very easy to make and it's cheap recipe healthy for the family bye guys see you again in my next vlog